Hey you guys, welcome back to Scent House. Okay, today's video. All right, let's just start over. We aren't going anywhere right now, right? Because we're staying home a lot. So I decided that I'm just gonna go ahead and give my patio a little makeover. There's nothing going on on my patio. It's very bland. All I have out here is some chairs. That's it, and a rug. And why is the rug out here? I really don't know. <laughs> But I have chairs that are stacked. I have stains on the floor. And um, those stains, I tried to clean the stains up and uh, made it worse. So I'm going to try and cover those up. I did want to use a pressure washer to clean it up, but my husband loaned it out. He's at work, so I, I wasn't waiting on him to get home. So I'm going to do this anyways. Um, if you want to see what this looks like when I get done, please keep watching. Okay, y'all, my husband is helping me out. This table was white, and he's going to paint it with some leftover chalk paint that we had, and I believe it's like a peppercorn or something like that. I'm not sure, but the paint itself, I did get it from Walmart. He also painted the chairs as well. Okay, what he's doing right now is hanging these screw-in hooks for me so that I can hang my curtains. And what I did was I bought three shower curtain rods to hang up here because you guys know um, curtain rods are kind of expensive depending on the width that you need. So I didn't want to spend too much money on shower, I mean, um, curtain rods because it's outdoors and it's going to be you know exposed to the elements so um why not just do the shower curtain rods and that's what i did i'm gonna hang my curtains using those also guys when i tell you that pollen was everywhere that the pollen was everywhere it was thick and it was a lot of it so i had to basically wipe everything down out here before i could even get started with anything so that's what i'll be doing and then once i get done with that we'll get to the fun part which is adding a little decor Welcome to those of you who are new or just stopping by. If you're not a subscriber, right now would be a good time to go ahead and hit that subscribe button if you like videos like this. And don't forget to hit the notification bell, double tap it so you won't miss any future videos. Returning family members, welcome back family and thank you guys so much for all of your support. As always, guys, like I always say, you can make your refresh or makeovers as expensive as you like or on a budget. I always choose budget-friendly. That's what my channel is all about, bringing you home decor styling ideas all on a budget, okay? You can add or take away from these styling ideas. I'm just bringing you guys a little inspiration.
Okay, at this point right here, I was tired, I was sweating. <laughs> I had to take a little break. I needed a break, but then I got right back up and got back to that we would never work out I know that someone would get hurt I think I have to let you go should be easy but it's not cause the problem is I love you what to do I count to three when you're next to me I love you what to do now do now Problem is I love you. What to do? You got me bound. Make my world spin round. I love you. What to do now? I want you. Stuck inside my head. Oh, I can't stop thinking about all the words you said. I think I have to let you go. Should be easy, but it's not. I. Only problem is I love you. What to do? You got me bound. Okay, y'all, I will be using this drop cloth as my curtains now. I didn't measure anything. I eyeballed everything that I did for these curtains, so I'm praying that they come out right. This drop cloth was um, one big um, piece of cloth. So what I did was I cut it in three pieces because I knew I was going to need at least three pieces for the bigger um, window. So um, that's what I did. I cut that in three pieces and then I trimmed it off because it was too long. And then what I'm going to do is I'm going to fold the top of the drop cloth to make me like a faux hem. And then I'm going to clip on the um, curtain clips. Okay, y'all, let's see how these curtains turned out.
respect how you feel, but baby, I'll never go that far, cause I know better than that, so baby, let me hold you, hold you. Oh yeah, y'all. I did buy two packs of the drop cloth. I bought a large pack. I think it was $22. And then I bought a smaller pack. And this one, the one that I'm hanging now, which is the smaller pack, was $16, I believe. And I just cut those in half. Let me show you what love is. Why it's beautiful. Just put your body on top of mine. Yeah. I'm gonna treat you the same way as all the girls who have no shame. Y'all, I did put these cushions on backwards, but I'll fix those later. Okay, y'all, this is my small patio makeover. Also guys, I didn't like the placement of the rug, so you will see that I moved them in the next clip. When I tell you that it's been hot here in Florida, it's been really hot. But with the ceiling fan going, and when I close the curtains to block out some of the sunlight, it's been shady on this patio. So it's been feeling really nice out here.
if you're planning on refreshing your patio i hope that this video gave you some type of inspiration and some ideas I will be showing how this space looks at night, so make sure you guys stick around. Guys, at night, it is so relaxing out here. I didn't spend a lot of money on this space. I wasn't trying to spend a lot of money on this space, but the few touches that were added really made a difference to this space. All right, you guys, that's a wrap. I hope you enjoyed this video. As always, if you did, please give it a thumbs up. Don't forget to comment down below. And thank you guys so, so much for watching. And I'll see you all on the next one. Bye, guys.